Here we go again with another Cool Loser Tech video, and these are the best games of the week, so let's do it, do it. Well, what do you know? It's the Cool Loser for show. Here on Cool Loser Tech, let's stop the show. As of now, I think you guys are aware they need to scan this QR code, so it gives you the list of the apps and games that I'm about to review for this video. And now let's get to the best live wallpaper of the week. It is called KF Flames. Flames in the background. Transition my screen, you can see the fire kind of move around. That's basically what it is. But this is the free version. If you get a paid version, you can put pictures in the background and tweak little different colors. So yeah, obviously my phone's on fire. My phone's hot. Alrighty, let's get to the best games of the week now. And I'll start it off with Death Rally. If you're familiar with the movie called Death Race, this is what it's kind of based off of. So you get to drive a car and destroy cars and you got to race. Right now you start off with one car, you can upgrade your weapons. Let's go into the pit. Here we can see it's waiting for me to go. I'm going to try using my fingers. Usually it's better when you hold it. But I'm going to try playing it this way so I don't move my screen around. And there we go. So we see we get cars driving around and there's my thing automatically shooting. You can pick up health, boost. And there we go. And here's the shoot button. You see I got my shotgun. So that's like my special weapon and I got five now. The graphics doesn't look bad on this at all. Let's see if I can destroy this guy. Oh. There's some money I picked up. And you can see my meter. Bump up my handling. And that's all I got. Once you play, it's going to be pretty cool. I like this game. I definitely recommend you to go try this out. Next up, we have Dark Legends. This game right here is about vampires and zombies. Log in to play. Our menu, after we've already set up everything, you'll have to pass the training to get to different spots and to be able to customize your avatar and get different weapons. You can name your guy. My guy's name is... Oops. Jump into play. Here you can see the missions that I passed, but it has a pretty cool like little storyline to it. This is also a multiplayer game where you can play online with different people. Follow the horde. Another zombie outbreak just happened. So that's that little scene. Let's click on this one. Multiplayer. There we go. This is actually the part where you go into action. And here I am. Here's my cursor to move my guy. Here's another real-time player. And there's my action buttons that I can do. Here's my health. And slice these mofos. Oops. I guess I didn't show too much. There you go. You can collect money, collect different things there. Whoa. And this special right here, this does special when you see the mouth open. Right there. He goes crazy vampire mode, and let's collect this. Let's move on. Ooh. So you see the action that's going to be played in this. Keep advancing as you play with these players. Want to try it out for yourself. Next up, we have Mini Bash. Now this game, I found myself, I couldn't put it down. Honestly guys, I was having lots of fun with this game. I was like, what? I don't, like, it was just so unique. It, I just, check it out. Click continue. Here's all the people that are going to be playing. First round, the Cool Loser versus Yogurt. I feel like this game is just awesome. Like, I want to keep it. And you see the extra moves that you see in the background? Those are his moves that he'll be doing when I press this play button. Here's your timer. And he gets to do whatever he can, too. I don't get to see it until I press play. So let's go for it. And there's his move, and there's my move. So he moved me a little bit. Let's fix my footing here. So your momentum was already going this way, so it's gonna keep, like it, we really are falling that way, even though that you move the body, you can see how that falls. So I'm just gonna end up kicking, see if I could kick his leg. There you go, that's his health, that's my health. Right there, see that will launch me, so let's go. There we go, <laughs> nut crusher. See, he can still hit me and I still got more moves to do, so let's see if I can fix myself. To do a little bit more damage. I could actually chop his head off if I hit him hard enough. Let's see if that will do. Oop, there he hit me with his leg. That's it. So there's a replay. Nut crusher. You won the first round. Isn't this, this game is so weird, I love it. 
standings right here. I move on. To lower it there. Let's see if I can hit him. There we go. <laughs> you won the quarterfinals. There I am. These are the four people now. Will the coup loser win the semifinals? And let's go. Oh! And he broke my head. So you get the game. Try it out for yourself. Next up, we have Mini Game Paradise. Let's go into the game. We see mini games here. Let's start off with one game. Go here. We see the little gameplay. What you can do. That's the direction he's gonna go. It's a traveling game where you just gotta get the furthest you can. Oh. Collect stars. Obviously, if you want to get more stars to unlock different levels. So you're gonna have to play quite a few of the same levels to unlock. Go to the next game. You see? Can't touch any of these little things that are coming around. You can land on their heads. And it changes the direction. Do not hit them. Make sure they don't hit you. But you gotta get down as far as you can. Ooh. Collect stars. Ow. Ooh, lucky me. Ooh. So you can go as quick as you can. Ah, oh, and it caught up to me. Go next game. This is a skiing one. I'm not gonna go into it. And they can go here. And we see jumping over your characters. So you can see these other levels you're gonna be able to unlock. Go try it out for yourself. Next up, we have Ninja Royale. You get to pick a character and you get to sign in as a little social network gameplay. Let's go into missions, select it, and you get into this little map where you gotta press go and read the subtitles. So I'll go read, and then boss battle. There's the boss mode, whatever. I'm gonna skip through this stuff. Here's the boss, and as you see he's throwing stuff, I have to throw things back at it, make sure it doesn't hit me or slice it. I can slice him or hit, throw ninja stars at this thing. And there we go. And I won, I just beat it. So this is the very beginning of the stage where it's kind of easy. This is just this level, there's other ones where things will come out and you have to keep hitting little barrels and things will pop up and you just gotta hit. Go try it out for yourself. Next up we have Twist Monkey. Simple game and yet I really enjoyed it. Here's different worlds and this world has a pretty good amount of levels. We see a little monkey head and we gotta cool them off inside here. You can see there's a throw button, rotation and refresh so that's your restart. Throw is to throw the little guy, and that wasn't the best, so let's refresh. If you don't like the rotation it's going, you can rotate it and make it do it this way. And toss it in. And there you go. The levels start getting really challenging where you're like, at first I was like, well, this game isn't that good. But it gets interesting and all the stuff that you gotta do to complete the missions. And let's go into 13 and show you how much different it gets. There'll be like different structures inside that will bounce your guy here. I gotta destroy this little thing on the bottom. There you go. And now get the monkey guy, oops. And let's throw. Perfect, oh no. It's a quiet game, I don't know if you would like that or not, but works pretty cool, try it out. Next up we have One Touch. I like these type of puzzle games where you have to think and how to complete it. And here is what you gotta do. So let's start off in this corner and let's do this. Stage clear. This corner. Sweet. Next stage. Um, let's see, let's start off with up here. There you go. And this was the easiest one. Everybody knows how to do starts. And then it gets harder and harder and different things are gonna pop up in different ways. I liked it, try it out for yourself. Next up we have Feed Your Dino. This game's gonna be very familiar to you and you'll see different levels here, as in worlds. You can click into it and we got different stars. We can see all these levels in this world. And I'll start off with one. Slicing the rope will get you stars. And then drop. And Dino got to eat the candy. Cut the rope. <laughs> Cut this up. Oh, didn't do it right. You're gonna see bubbles, different things you gotta cut through. Cut that. Ah. 
can't let it go out of the screen, but there we go. And let it eat it. And there's three. Excellent. Next stage is... Oh, wrong, wrong cut. But you get the game. Lots of levels for you to cut through. It's a strategy game. Think about it. Do it to it. And last but not least, we have Hybris. This game was interesting enough to review it for you guys. And I'm just going to click on this world. And here you can see your guy. It's like a gladiator type of time. And then let's move it around. And you'll see like little armadillos. I'm not sure what they are. But here's your attack button. Attack it. So that coins. And there's your door. You Things you gotta fight. The action is not all crazy. Oops. Oops. Ah. Oh wow. There's little Mogwai's friends. And I killed Mogwai's friend. Oh that was close. Go through the levels. You'll see different little things going on. Try it out for yourself. And there you have it. This concludes the best games of the week right off Google Play. Brought to you by me, The Cool Loser. And as always, thank you guys for joining. Please rate, comment, and subscribe. And don't forget to spread the word of The Cool Loser. Tell your friends, tell your mom, tell your pops, tell your girlfriend, tell your grandpa, tell your aliens, tell everybody. Tell your bugs, tell your pets. But anyways, guys, thank you. As always, I love you guys. And hope you guys enjoy these little games. And yes, I'm going to start getting into higher end games. So I'm slowly working in more of the higher end games. But you know... I'm not leaving you lower end devices behind. As you can see, I got games for you. Alrighty, I will see you guys on Monday. Later. The